like my women like a lot of my money Green, a little jealous Sing it! Alright guys! Welcome back uh, to my December favourites of 2017 OMG 2017 is over, like, are we kidding? Are we joking? That went by like slight um, issues today with filming. I woke up, yeah, and I was like, I'm pumped. Like, I'm gonna film a video, this is gonna be awesome. Like, just have my favorites, are you kidding? Slash kind of 2017 favorites, I'm not gonna lie, but like, these are things that I've been using consistently throughout, throughout December, so. Anyway, I got up, yeah, and I was like, so motivated. Do you know how much has gone wrong today? I just can't even comprehend like the tragedy that has gone on today. First of all, I filmed this whole video already. Like it was literally like 40 minutes long. My microphone didn't work because I have a new microphone, yeah? So I was like really excited about using said microphone. I go to edit and you know, the like. Um, tell me why there's no sound. So here we are, and it's so annoying because I lost natural light, so now I'm in this artificial office looking lighting. I mean, it's awful, I'm so sorry guys. Like honestly, I don't have my lights as I've previously explained. It's a bit of a myth right now with lighting and filming. I'm back in my dad's office. Hey, thanks dad. And I just wanna share with you what I've been loving. Um, luckily, obviously Christmas was the other day, so I've got some stuff that I was like, oh, I wanna share with everyone and kind of like, rave about a little bit if you're new hey welcome to the party if you're not holla boo like we love each other no but really <laughs> if you're returning like because it takes a lot to stick through with all of this okay so let's get into the video come on all right so first and foremost wait super important i am partial Magnifico. I'm starting off <laughs> with, I guess what you could call kind of slightly boring items. They're not boring to me, like, I love them. First and foremost, I'm starting off with my bio oil. <laughs> now I know I'm not gonna recommend this too heavily because obviously I'm not a dermatologist. I'm not kind of a qualified clinician. So I can't tell you if this will fix like definitely fix all your skin issues. But I know a couple people who use it, my mum loves it, and I literally have never had more glowing skin than after I apply a bit of bio oil. Um, you can see that actually in my skincare routine plug, which I'll pop down below and, I, and how I use it and whatever. But seriously, especially during the winter months, this has rescued my skin, like so moisturized, so hydrated, and it is so lovely to put on before makeup and also as a part of my skincare routine before my night cream. 10 out of 10 would recommend, um, but also don't like take my word on it, don't come for me if it's like not doing what you want it to, but for me, like I can't see why it wouldn't. Like I love it. Which brings me on to the next little item, which is my Max Studio Fix Fluid Foundation. Now this is cheating a little bit because obviously I've re-bought this this year. Um, but I love it so much. I had a real issue finding a foundation, to be honest. Like, I'm kind of, I love to change my foundations because I'm always looking for like different kind of looks. Like one minute I want super like light coverage, dewy, and the next I want like cake face. I'm kind of in my, I wouldn't say cake face phase, but this is great coverage, like full. I used to use NARS, which I swore by, and I still do. The only thing I had a problem with NARS is that it oxidizes quite layered and that stressed me out a little bit because I would think everything was fine and dandy and then I would go into public looking like a satsuma. Um, this one really doesn't, like literally, like I really, really love this one. It like kind of matches your skin so well, like as you're wearing it, it doesn't get orange throughout the day or cakey or and it doesn't move like at all. Like I will say that about this foundation. So 100% would recommend this. If you're similar skin tone to me, I use NC35. So if you have like yellowy undertones in your skin, um, kind of olive, more olive skin, Mediterranean, whatever you want to call me or you or whoever's looking for this, <laughs> that's what's going on with that one. 
I have to be a bit snappy with this because like literally I ramble so freaking bad. Editing is a disaster because I'll edit and I'll be like, oh great, I've edited it and it'll be like 25 minutes and I'm like, hey. So my next product that I am going to talk about is my Origins Clear Improvements Charcoal Mask. Now let me tell you about this. I used to work for um, an Estee Lauder outlet company. So we had all the kind of Estee brands and all the girls, we would always try all the different face masks and this one was always a winner. Um, hence why I bought like three. <laughs> it really clears your pores, like wow. The only thing I would say is I love this and my skin feels like rejuvenated. I don't use it like often, once a week maybe. Um, just because it's, it is quite heavy duty for your skin and I don't have sensitive skin, but if you do, like maybe patch test it. I get a little bit red after this. Now, I know that that like, people are gonna be like, oh, you're like, you know, this irritates your, like that means it irritates your skin. But I don't think it, it do, it's not painful, it's not itchy, it's nothing. It just gets a bit red and I think that's just because it's quite intense and my skin feels amazing afterwards. So I'm never gonna stop. So obviously if you don't have a painful reaction, then like it's fine. But um, don't be alarmed, I guess, is what I would say for this, if you come up a little bit red. Like, it's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I mean, obviously, don't, like, hurt yourself. But for me, I get a little bit red, but I love the results. Now, I know everyone's probably getting sick and tired of me ranting about lashes, but honest to God, like, this is, like, a genuine passion. This isn't me, like, saying it because, like, whatever. It's no, it's not paid promo or anything. I mean, obviously, it's not paid promo. Who do I think I am? You know what I mean? It's not, like, someone, like, telling me to talk about these lashes. ER Beauty Lashes, guys, get to know. They look like this and they are just so stunning. I can't even cope. Anyway, you, you've you heard it on my last, pretty much every single makeup video I do. <laughs> I talk about them because it's literally all I wear and like, they're so nice. Like, I get the most compliments when I wear them and they just look great in pictures and ah, oh, I love them so much. Also, if you want to invest, they're not expensive by the way, that's another perk. I have a coupon code which I'll also link in the description, um, that Lucy, D-A-T Lucy, for 60% off all their lashes. I mean, are you kidding? These are luxury mink lashes, like what? It comes to like eight pounds, I think. Like, are you kidding? Hello, ding dong, do it before it's gone. Also, if you spend over 20 pounds, you get a free pair. So I mean, you're really not losing. <laughs> but yeah, so those are my diehard lashes that I, I just got this pair and I've got about three like in the past week because I am obsessed. Okay, now my next um, item is, I am a perfume, crazy woman <laughs> i love perfume i have about 600 different bottles okay that's a lie but i have a lot like it pisses people off because i have like a lot and they're like lucy do you even use all these i do i do use every single bottle i use them all but this one is cheating a bit <laughs> also because i have rebought this this month actually so it's not something that i've just discovered in december and i'm like wow but it is my favorite my prada a perfume. Now I know like people might think it's a bit silly to like splurge on a perfume. That's like totally fine. I totally get it. I think like a lot of stuff is overpriced. But this is a scent that I go back to every time and I love like and it lasts long. The bottle lasts forever. I mean geez. If you're looking to splurge a little bit, um, the Prada Candy scent is literally incredible. I'm just going to spray a bit now. Oh, look. Uh, no, it's in my mouth. Oh my god. And I don't like that. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, well, just so you know, smells fab on, not great to eat. So my next product, kind of going on the same kind of luxe vein, I guess. My Valentino sunglasses. Now I know this is a little bit, some people won't want to pay this for sunglasses and I like get it 100%. They are so amazed. I'm gonna put them on now. <laughs> I mean, it's me. They're just so diva. Like, they're just everything that I, like, love. Like, just diva. I love the white and they go with, like, any outfit. And, 
yeah i really love these and also like i can just facade any emotion like who knows how i'm feeling right now like no one that's just how it goes if i am looking like a trash dumpster i put these on i mean they fill up my freaking face so i can just cover all my pain and agony just with these i mean it's incredible <laughs> Okay, now I'm straying a little bit from the whole beauty kind of side of things and I'm going to talk about these boots. But I love these so much, like so much. I was looking for like sock boots for a very long time, but these are so much better. I got them from Public Desire. The only thing is they, I had to trade, I had to exchange these because the, I got them in a six. Normally I'm a true six, but these um came up a little bit tight around my foot i think just because they're like pointed and i don't know they just were a bit tight so i had to go a size up in the seven they have like a faux suede kind of exterior here and then the heel is like i guess faux snake skin is the kind of vibe they're going for i also like them because they're a lot sturdier than a sock boot like initially i was looking for a sock boot but these like because they're faux suede they just kind of i don't know are more comfortable because there's more support like on your ankle and everything you know okay so the next thing that i'm gonna talk about is these products which i had no idea about my mum got them for me because she'd seen good reviews or something like that on online and i was really intrigued because the packaging is incredible o2o um enhancer drops so they look like this which is just an incredible packaging like i am all for this unicorn kind of a thing going on here my mom got them in a, a set of six <laughs> so i have six different shades which i'm so excited i'm not too sure if i'm gonna add them to my foundation or um, just use them as highlighters but i'll swatch them really quickly now just so you can have a little look because the, i'm not gonna lie that the colors are incredible like i'm so excited to use them the color is just like incredible um and yeah i'm really excited to use this i'm not gonna lie this is something that i'm quite hyped about and they smell okay bear with me this is about to get really technical but they smell between a mix of davidoff cool water perfume and hollister body spray now if you were about in eighth grade year nine oh my goodness you know that that is all we wore <laughs> now my final thing is a very special thing for me um i was very kindly given by my parents a very special gift which does not happen normally can i just say i'm not a spoiled brat this is not a common occurrence in the Faha household. I talk about Valentino quite a lot. I, I love Valentino as a brand. I obviously have the sunglasses, you know, I kind of, I kind of rep it. I've been talking about the, I can't even, like I'm looking at them and I'm literally gonna cry. The Valentino heels um, for a very long time. And my mother got a pair. It's just, she knows how much I love pastel. I can't, I can't tell you guys, like I could, like I was on the verge of tears when I got this. They are the most beautiful shoe I've seen in my life. So I like literally, I can't even tell you how excited I am for those. But yeah, that was my big like Christmas miracle that happened on that day. I can't wait to wear this. I'm not doing anything for New Year's, so I don't know when I'm going to wear them, like what special event. Like maybe I'll just wear them around the house. Do I care? Like, no. I'm so beyond excited and so beyond grateful, and they are so pretty. All right, guys. Well, that is everything I've been loving this month, slash a couple that have been like repeat buys. Oops. I hope you enjoyed. I'm really sorry about this lighting, guys, but honestly, like, be kind to me because today has been such a card car crash and i'm sorry if it isn't like a good quality but i hope that it's okay enough thank you guys so much for joining me anyway like i always appreciate it so much and please like comment share um and subscribe to my channel if you would like to anyway have a lovely day guys or evening you know what it is um i'll see you next time